Okay, so I'm going to overclock this now and do a Vantage Benchmark. So right now you can see I'm turning up all the cores. 3.7 gigahertz. Alright, that's done. She might need me stable when I hit supply. But we'll try it anyway. Apply. As you can see it says, are you going to be stable? We don't know. Oh, mouse is still working. It seems to be uh, stable. The frequency is 232, 1.4 volts. Northbridge is 1.15. DRAM is 1.5, which is what it's supposed to run at. Just for fun, let's bring this up a bit more. Jesus, going yellow. <laughs> Mouse is still working. We're at 3840. Now, CPU Z is saying 963, but I think that's to do with uh, this Turbo Core stuff I don't really know much about right yet. Putting down a keyboard. Now, I have a 10 minute limit here, so I might have to push the record button and join up the parts after. But we'll see if I can get through this benchmark in under eight minutes. Sorry, locked up. Oh, locked up cold turkey. Well, that's a fail. Okay, the last one just failed, so I'm not gonna bring up the. I'm actually gonna bring down the CPU frequency, but I'm gonna bring a multiplier up to 16 on each core again. I'm not gonna bring this down. Uh, let's say. 225. Apply, yes. Mouse still works. Alright. Close off. 3.6. That's what she's running at, all six cores. Let's try it again. I'm not overclocking my uh, NVIDIA GTX 460 at all. All right, let's give her another try. Moving the mouse, it's still moving. That was a bit weird. All right, next attempt. Uh, let me see. Let's bring this down to... 210 CPU ratio. Man, Jesus. So 15.5. All right. Apply. No. Toast it again. All right. Rather than mess with the fucking uh, CPU ratio and anything else, because I'm having all kinds of issues trying to get this thing to fucking do the benchmark without locking up. She's running at 3.2 now. I got that little switchy thing you turned on in the motherboard. Let's just try this just to see what she'll do. If she doesn't lock up, she's not already broke. Oh my god damn Windows 7. Shut the fuck up! You little beat on. You want the old beat on session? It's my video, not yours. No, don't lock up. You can do it. Just kick them in the bars. There we go. Okay, the RAM is set to auto. I had it set to 1567 or whatever the fuck it was. Um, this is with that little turbo switch on, and that's it. Everything else is set to auto. Hurry up and run. Fucking loading. I'll edit this. I probably needed to up the voltage. 
I'm not up for doing that. I'd rather not burn her up. Besides, I don't have the money to pay for uh, burnt out CPUs. My cat is insistent on uh, being in this video. We're probably going to get rid of her. She has a tendency to piss on shit. Not literally shit, no. But piss on clothing and blankets. Beat on session later. What am I getting? 39 frames. I can hear the fan picking up speed there now. What am I doing? I'm rolling a cigarette. That's my cigarette. I roll them. The water looks really nice. I think I still prefer Crisis though for water. Sorry about that, I just struck the tripod with my hand while trying to flick my cigarette. I have to say it's pretty warm here too. I don't know if that's uh, why I can't get a stable oval clock at 3.6. I could probably jack up the front side bus and get better luck than doing the multiplier. Again, I don't want to turn up the voltage. You might be comfortable with doing it, but I, I'm not. I don't have the money to repair something if it goes. It's a gorgeous benchmark. I'm not sure if this is actually 4x3 scaled to 16x9 or not. It is circles or ovals. You think this vantage would be like a wide screen, even 16 by 10, which it actually might be, I'm not sure. I should go check that after. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous benchmark. This is an AMD 1055, if you don't know. It's running on a new Vega uh, 460 GTX, uh, the 768 megabyte one with their uh, crippled, it's three something, there's three instead of four on the one gig version, I'm not sure what it is. A little bit slower at higher resolutions. Uh, I have G Skill RAM, uh, it's a DDR3. Natively, we're supposed to run at 1600, but the motherboard only supports 1333. As again, I can jack up, jack up the frequency on it. All right. In the interest of time, I'm just gonna flip. Oh, this one loaded. Never mind. This is the ugliest fucking benchmark ever. I don't even know what the fuck is doing. Op OPS. What the hell is that? OPS. Operations. I think it would have made it a little bit more nicer. I know it's a CPU benchmark. I don't. I don't know if anything's running off the GPU. I guess the video is, but no pixel shaders. I think I'm not really sure how that one works. Now we do it again, where it's got the warming up, I believe. Well, my fan is spinning pretty fast, and I'm pretty sure she's warmed up. You don't believe me. It says warming up. And now here, for some reason, planes freeze. Why the hell do these planes here freeze? What's what's up with that? You might be able to hear the fan. She's 
getting faster and faster. What I think is holy. What I think it's doing is actually running all the graphics, the pixel shooters, and everything off the CPU instead of the GPU. That's all I can figure. Ooh, pretty, pretty boring. Again. Pretty boring. <clears throat> this video is going to shut off in T minus 38 seconds because my camera is being recorded 9:59 because I bought it as a camera and there's a rule that if they exceed 10 minutes they have to be registered as a camcorder and the price goes up. I'm figuring. So after this one, I'm going to click my fingers, and I'm going to do a edit. Hopefully I can get the whole thing, because I have like 10 seconds left. Come on, bitch, you can do it. And it's left. Hurry the fuck up, there's only a little blue flags. Interesting. I guess this is a physics benchmark. Oh, this is that particle test. I think that might have been the last one. No. Nope. Another one. Ooh, pretty funny. If you really look closely, you can see a uh, future mark, watermark, right in the background. I noticed that the other day. It's right in the background. And I brought it up a little bit. Gave me an extra, what did I say, 38, 300 points. Is an overclock really worth it? Not really, not for me. Anywho, that's my, uh, that's my benchmark. It's my little overclock I did. Thank you for joining me, and maybe I'll do some more later on. Bye bye.